Where am I? Who am I? Hold up. Is that the Flash over there? Hey, I think you're right. He looks hurt pretty bad. Yeah, this could be our opportunity to get rid of him. Hey, you were there. Me? Ugh. 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 Man, are you sure this is the Flash? He's not even fighting back. Doesn't matter if he is or just some idiot playing dress up. He's gotta have a wild on him. Please, don't. Leave me alone. You're the man. Leave him alone. And who the hell is this? The Flash's kid? Heh, <laughs> yeah. Beat it if you know what's good for you, Kid Flash. Kid Flash? Really? Okay, now I gotta punch you. Barry, you okay? Not that I'm ungrateful, but what are you wearing? Oh, this? It's just something Darwin whipped up for me before I came to get you. Who's Darwin? Wait, who are you? Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Darwin warned me about this. You lost your memory, didn't you? I... did? My name is Barry Allen. I am... My friends are Wally West and Darwin Elias. They told me who I am, and that's... Barry Allen? I'm not who you think I am. I'm not this Flash guy. I can't be some kind of superhero. Barry, you saw what I did when I saved you. It's proof that you can do the same thing. Why do you think you have that suit? I don't know, but you have to have made a mistake. This is more severe than I thought. I wish I could be of more help, but I need to know more, and you can't tell me anything about the future without risking the timeline. There's gotta be some other way to spark his memory. Whatever it is, we need to figure out before the Barry of this time comes to the lab. We can't risk the two of them seeing each other. That's the reason we came to this time point in the first place. He really isn't. Stop! You can't tell me anything, remember? Just knowing he gets super speed in the future could alter things. I don't need another dilemma. Right, uh, sorry. Maybe you're wrong, though. Maybe that's what Barry needs. If he sees himself, it might remind him why he's here. Well, as long as they don't interact with one another, just show him from afar. We'll see how it goes. Right, Barry? It's worth a shot. You and Daryl normally pass by this place after work. Maybe seeing them will remind you of who you are. Do you actually remember Daryl? Not really. Sorry. What? What, what about Iris? She... sounds familiar. We need to do something. Wait, look! You can't outrun me your time. You know you don't belong here. Come with me willingly this time, Thon. This guy knows Thon's posing as you? Thon? You call yourself the Lord of Time, but you never do anything other than interfere with it. Today's the day that ends. People are gonna get hurt if we don't do something. What are we supposed to do? <laughs> Wally! Oh god, what do I do? I'm pinned, Barry. You have to remember. You have to do this because it's what you've always done. You save people. You help them. It's who you are. Despite all the hate that Thawne brings, you care so much. You love your friends and family. You love your city and that's why you protect it. That's why... I'm the Flash. You remember! You're back! Thanks, Wally. Today, you saved me. But what about Thawne? He clearly doesn't value the lives of innocent people like we do. If we hadn't been here, bystanders could have died. I need to make him abandon the timeline. Not for the sake of my life, but the sake of others. Now that sounds like the Barry I know. Use the treadmill to come back to our time when you're done here. I'll see you soon. Over, Thawne. That's right. I know who you really are. That you're posing as me and trying to steal my light. It's not like that. I would never- Shut up. You're abandoning this point in time. Go back to your own. Make your own life. What? You don't understand. This is my life now. 
I found a woman that I love, and your friends are mine too. We can... No, no! My friends are not your friends. You're going to tell them that you're leaving, so they won't worry for the next year. That's how long it'll be before I return. You'll lie and say it's you who'll come back so they don't know you were pretending to be me all this time. That's my terms. You have no other choice. Please, don't do this. I'll lose everything. You should have thought about that in advance. Welcome back, Barry. Sorry for scaring you all. Thon just has a way of getting under my skin. We don't blame you for it, son. I'm just happy you're okay. I'm happy that everything went accordingly, too. Except, I need to tell you, I had a contingency in case things didn't go so well. What do you mean? I'm sure you all know that my line of work pertained to the possibility of human cloning. No. You didn't. You didn't! Barry, calm down! What did Darwin do? I... I cloned Barry. All the extra blood you were drawing from me. It wasn't for Velocity 9. You were trying to make a clone. Oh, no, 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 no. I can't be right. Please tell me this isn't true. I made it so he has all the memories Barry has. He's a perfect replica, just in case something ever happened. The city needs a flash. I'm sorry, Darwin, but that's insane. You took it too far! Never mind all that. Just, where is it, Darwin? Hold still. That would defy the point of my super speed, though. Sort of like how your strength just makes you a lummox. And that's exactly why I managed to beat you. Screw you, Flash. Oh, he isn't the Flash. He's simply just a pollux of what Flash is. See, I studied Barry Allen for the majority of my life. You're no Barry Allen. Yet you still wear the colors of his most prideful years. The time he became most powerful yet to come. So who are you to try and take his mantle? I may not be able to kill him, but I can certainly find joy in killing you. What are you talking about, Thawn? Oh, bravo. You really are convincing. Unless you truly don't realize. Oh, that's phenomenal. You're a clone. A lab experiment. A temporary fix until the real Flash returns. You're nothing. You're lying. Only time will tell. There he is. What happened here? Wally. It was Thon. Wait, who? Thon? What'd he do? Who are you? What did Thon say? That I'm a clone. Darwin never told him. This is all still so surreal to me. I mean, clones? It's no walk in the park for me either. I just wonder what we're going to do about him now that I'm back. Guys, are you forgetting that Darwin made the clone to begin with? He never mentioned anything, you just did it. I know. It does raise a few questions. Darwin has been with us for years. Even though what he did was wrong, his intentions were in the right place and he's helped us on more occasions than we can count on both hands. So you're telling me we're just going to let him slide? Barry, this is something serious. He cloned you. I know. It still doesn't change anything, though. If I learn anything from my trip to the past, it's that we need to not let our emotions cloud our judgment. Darwin's still one of us, despite his mistake. Pollux and I talked things over. He wanted to say a few words to you all. I'm moving to Keystone City, where I can make my own life. You dyed your hair? And got a real name. I'm not just Pollux now. I decided to be called Johnny Quick. Thon told me the truth to try and put us against one another. But it only made me realize I can be my own person. That's great. I'm happy for you. Thank you for doing this, Johnny. No, thank you, Barry. This is so weird. Definitely weird.